and welcome back to my channel. It is Monday, January 20th, and as you can see, I have a Diamond Art Club unboxing. I had taken it out of the original box already, which you can see it is right here. I had to fight getting it out for some reason. So I've already got that out, but I waited to do this part. I took the plastic off already. So I have some, um, a little bit of an announcements. <clears throat> Tomorrow, January 21st, I will go live from 7 a.m. to 9 a.m. Pacific time. That is my um, normally scheduled live. I usually go live with Diamond Painting with Ash Inc. 93. But she is working now, so I will be doing this live by myself. I have some announcements that I will be making tomorrow during the live concerning um, my the schedule and giveaways that I will be um, getting ready to have. So if you are interested, I would love to have you join me in my live tomorrow. And um, we're gonna get me it's. My schedule's been kind of crazy. I had more scheduled ideas or ideas for scheduling, but the past week and a half, two weeks has been my son had some health issues. My husband got sick with a cold. Um, trying to catch, still trying to catch up from the holidays. So now things are a little more calm, and I will be able to get a, a weekly schedule up. I will be having whipping chats. I will have I'm looking at doing two whipping chats a week. I will have my live. As for unboxings, this is the last unboxing. Um, and I know I think it's my first or this is my second unboxing, but this will be the last unboxing I have for a while. I'm this broke my no buy because I had to have this, but I am back on a no buy. So um, well, actually, I will have two more unboxings. I've purchased them. I'm just waiting for them to come. So there will actually be two more unboxings. I'm expected to get them on Friday, the 24th. I will be doing two separate videos for those unboxings. But I will go into more details tomorrow in my life concerning my channel updates and the schedule that I will be putting into effect as of this, as of today. Today is the first day of my of what my schedule is going to be. It's just today is an unboxing. Next Monday will be probably the other unboxing for what I'm waiting for um, on Friday. And then the following Monday, I will be doing another unboxing. After that, to the best of my knowledge, unless something shows up that I'm unaware of, um, yeah, it, unboxings and unbaggings and such will be put on hold for a little while, but I will be doing whip and chats. I'm going to be doing two whip and chats each week. One is going to be part of my slash my stash from 2019, my 2019 uh, paint diamond paintings that I plan on finishing here in 2020. Another one will be a Hannah Lynn collab that I'm doing with, um, several other um, YouTubers and creators. I will link the two YouTubers that started this. I will link their information in the description box below. And then I also will possibly put in a third whip and chat. We'll see how it goes. Let's, let's, let's start off with this for now. But Okay, so this is a painting that I had to have, like I said, or purchased this January 11th. It shipped out on January 12th, and I received it January 18th. And I had to have this one even though I was on a no-buy. I was afraid if I waited, it would be gone. Um, that happened with a few other paintings that I had waited on, and sometimes you learn your lesson from that. <laughs> that sometimes it's good to wait... Other times, not such a good idea. So, 
The painting that I had to have is Cassia. Yes. Sorry. I don't know how clear this is. I don't think it's very clear. Let me see here if I spread a little bit of natural light on the subject, if it clears up any. Oh, goodness. My light's not coming on. There we go. I'm sorry, everything is so blurry today. <clears throat> Let's see. Does that help any? Yeah, my camera's not not cooperating. But this is what it is. Hopefully, I can figure out why I'm not getting anything clear. Hold on just a minute. Let me close this and see if it helps. Sometimes natural light isn't always the best lighting. Now I have things falling over. All right. Let me see here. Let's see if you can see it better on the sticker. I apologize for this. I'm still getting used to recording. There we go. That looks like it's a little clearer. So Cassia is, as seen on there, it's around with AB. It's 56 by 71. The artist is Nikki Burnett. I'm sure many of you have already seen this unboxing done a couple times and have also seen this in this particular um, picture in her coloring book, in Nikki Burnett's coloring books. I've seen Stitcherista as Nikki Burnett coloring books, so you may have seen this in one of her flip throughs that she has done. Um, and like I said, uh, Diamond Art Addiction. Cherry, she unboxed this. She's currently working on this right now. And that is something that I will be also um, part of my discussion this coming week in either my whip and chat or my live tomorrow is um, something me and Cherry are talking about doing. So and set that off to side here. <sighs> Diamond Art Club tool kit. It comes with My multi-placer always gets left behind here. So it comes with, I can never remember if this is a four-placer or a five-placer. I've got to learn, because I don't use it. I don't I don't like these thicker multi-placers. I use the thinner multi-placers that look like, let me see here if I can find one that's not loaded with wax. There we go. I prefer these thinner multi-placers, and this is a four-placer. These are the ones that I use. So the other ones I just have a stash of. It comes with plastic bags. Those will be sent to Miss Coffee. Comes with two heart-shaped pieces of wax. A clear tray with a funnel a blue pen with a single placer, and a squishy. Let's go ahead and get this off to the side. <clears throat> so, yes, I am involved in the Slash and Stash. I have several paintings I have started that in 2020, or 2019, that I need to get finished here in 2020, as well as I have Kits that I kitted up, or paintings that I kitted up in 2019 that I will be working on before I kit up anything else. This this is it. <laughs> I can't kit up any. I don't have enough storage systems for anymore. So I have to get some finished before I can kit any more up. And it comes with 
your step-by-step -step instructions. Thank you for purchasing a little note from Diamond Art Club. Your nine steps for diamond painting. And comes with a 10% off your next purchase coupon. Set these diamond drills off to the side. I'm going to roll this the other way so it can lay flat. Hopefully, you can see this. I'm in a different um, room than my previous recordings because my son is upstairs in my craft room playing video games. So, I had to come down in my living room and get this done before my husband gets off of work. So here we go. Yes, you're not going to be able to get a good view of this, and I apologize. In, not in full view. I'll have to kind of move it around. But here she is, Cassia from Nikki Burnett. Again, this comes in it's a 56 by 71 centimeters, which correlates to 22 by 28 inches round with 41, 41 colors, and that includes two ABs. Absolutely stunning. This painting is going to be unbelievable. Love these canvases. They're so pliable. Love the glitter in the background. Love the fact they're poured glue. Poured glue means less river, well, less chance for rivers, less chance for popping drills. Because the girls actually, you don't have the rivers and the lift, uh, lifting glue like you have with double-sided adhesive. And always very sticky. You have your schematic on both the top right-hand side as well as so, schematic top right-hand side. And bottom left hand side, right here. Yes, this is this is just absolutely beautiful. Clear symbols. It might not be clear for you because my you might not be able to see the symbols. I apologize in advance. here. You can get up close and see the symbols. Let's see if we put some more light on the subject if we can see the symbols. There we go. I think that's, I think we might have it. I apologize. I'm going to have to do this in the other room the next time. But Go ahead and flip this over and we'll take a look at these drills. Something on the back of the canvas. I don't know what it is. Looks like grass. I, I don't have grass. We have artificial grass, so it didn't come from my yard. <laughs> All right. Where are these drills at? All right. So <clears throat> if the crinkle of the bag. Um, bothers you, please mute your phone or turn the volume down until you see that I've got these out. Alright. So there's a loose bag of 318. Let me bring it down here a little more. Maybe that might help. Alright, so... There's a loose bag of 318s. Get these all separated. Let's go ahead and do the small bags first. Usually I do the big bags, but I'm going to do the small ones today. So we have a bag of seven, 762. Bag of 210. 208. We have 758, 
336. It's a, a blue. We're really trying to see if we can get these colors in here. 38, 37. Eight ninety four, thirty six eighty five. We have three o two twenty four. No, three o two four. Eight o three, two o six, three twenty two. Now A B's, and I can see the sparkle. 141. And there's one of our 80s. This is one of my favorite of the 80s. 754. 797. We'll look back um, when I'm finished here at the um, where the ABs will go. I have a a pink a drill that popped out. I gotta see where that goes. I think I know where it is, but I'm not sure. I don't know if it's tearing the bag or if it was just somehow loose. So 797, 3770, 550, 3334, 30, 3861, and 3033. Alright, and then our next strip, these are our larger bags. Here. I don't know. Our first bag is 317. It's a charcoal gray. 327, like a dark orchid, maybe. 823, uh, navy blue, dark navy blue. And here's our second bag of ABs light pink. Our medium, like baby pink, it's 128, 939, midnight blue, 939 and three tens. They were my nemesis for several months while I worked on my Brooklyn Bridge. At 415, 151, 3350, 414. Lots of pinks and grays in this. 3326, two bags, 3326, love this pink. 413, 3731, or 30, yeah, 3731, 961, 3799, two bags of 310, 948, 893, and 3371. So those are all of our drills. Let's go ahead and take a look and see where these ABs go. Let me get to that right here. All right, so our ABs were 128 and 141. All right. Looking at this, we got our 128, which is number one. It's here in the background. It's a, a, it's like in the framing of, oh, this is so bad. Let's see if I adjust this. Sorry about the movement, y'all. Uh, that helps a little bit, not much. But this is, the ABs are gonna be a framing around her, down the pillars, on the outside of the pillars. Um, so these, like, these are like, you know, the, um, Almost like the frame around her, I guess, is how you would say it. And then our second AB is the white. And that is going to be right here. You're going to find that in the moon. It's, this is a moon behind her. If I can get that in there, let's see here. 
Oh, this is such a bad video. I am so sorry. I couldn't, I didn't want to kick my son off of the Xbox after he just got on. But yeah, it's, it's basically in the moon. Um, trying to see where else there's. There's some more number ones that'll be here than the pinks. And some more twos here. I've seen little bits and pieces of this from Diamond Art Addiction, and she's not showing a whole lot, a little at a time, but it's, this is absolutely going to be stunning. I can't wait to work on this. This is going to get put away, and this will be part of what I do um, over for Halloween, so this probably won't come out until September or October, well, late August, early September. But I look forward to working on this. This is going to be a fun painting to work on. So, um, again, I hope you all are having a wonderful Monday, no matter where it is you are in the world. If you're in a cold climate, I hope you're keeping warm. If you're in a warmer climate, I hope you're keeping cool. And I look forward to seeing you all tomorrow for my live from 7 a.m. to 9 a.m. Pacific time. And see what kind of mischief I can get myself into this week. Last week, last week I had myself in mischief on my live. If, I haven't, if you haven't watched my live from last week and you want, a, you want a good laugh, check out last week's live. But um, if you like this video or any of my videos, please give me a thumbs up. Um, please know I am... New at this, I am really trying to get the hang of lighting and camera angles and feeling comfortable and relaxed um, in my speaking. So please be, you know, bear with me, be patient. Um, everybody has to start somewhere, and mine's just a little shakier than I had anticipated. But please hit the bell if, if subscribe and hit the bell if you'd like to see future videos and hear more about the giveaway that will be taking place. I will go ahead and link the two channels that are doing the Hannah Lynn paintings. I will link those in the description box below. Please give me a thumbs up. If not, that's fine. I understand. And But I would appreciate it if you would share um, my channel. I'd, and I look forward to seeing you again soon. See you tomorrow. Take care. Thanks, guys. Bye-bye.